This is the Cholo News Report for Sunday 25, November, 2018. Syrian state media report that more than 50 civilians are injured in a suspected poison gas attack by Syrian rebels on Elpo. Abdul Razak served in Syria's chemical weapons program before defecting to join the opposition in the early years of the conflict, which began in 2011. Rami Abdurrahman, the head of Britain-based Syrian Observatory for Human Rights, said there was a stench of gas in Elpo city after projectiles were fired. Elpo police chief Esam al told State TV, the projectiles landed in the al Khalidia neighborhood, and wind conditions caused gas to spread. U.S. President Donald Trump announces that migrants seeking asylum at the southern border will wait in Mexico, while their claims are processed in U.S. courts. Mexico's incoming foreign minister Marcelo Ebrard denies an agreement has been reached, and says, The conflicting statements emerged after the Washington Post reported Mexican officials had agreed to let migrants trying to enter the United States stay in Mexico, while their asylum claims were heard. But Mr. Ebrard, who will become foreign minister in December after Andres Manuel López Obrador's administration takes power, said the United States had yet to even send a specific proposal on how to deal with the issue. Thousands of migrants including women and children are currently at the US-Mexico border, after traveling more than 4,000 kilometers from Central America.